Your lease is coming to an end. What do you do now? Here at the Edwards Auto Group, we make this process easy for you. About 90 days before your lease is up, you should get information from your leasing company. This is your chance to decide to keep the vehicle and purchase for the residual amount, or return the car and lease or purchase another one. If you do decide to return your leased vehicle, about a month prior to the return date, you will need to call your leasing company to schedule an appointment for someone to come and inspect your vehicle. It is to your advantage to have your car looking nice, so you should make sure the vehicle is clean with all of your personal belongings removed. Once the inspection is complete, you'll receive a condition report listing any damage above normal wear and tear and the cost to fix those problems. It is better to get the inspection done early because if there are problems, you can fix them yourself and save some money. Next, you will need to call Edwards to schedule your lease trade-in. On the day you return your vehicle, remember to bring everything along that was in the car when leased, including all keys, owner, and service manuals. You will be charged at that time for the lease turn-in fee, along with any fees for excess mileage or wear and tear if applicable. Finally, lease or purchase another vehicle from any Edwards Auto Group dealer. For your next vehicle lease, visit the Edwards Auto Group, I-80 Lake Manoa exit in Council Bluffs and just off the Kennedy Freeway at the Fork Road exit in Bellevue.